Tomorrow begins the ninth legislative day of the 2020 legislative session here in Alabama. We thought this would be a good opportunity to come and visit with you and kind of give you an idea of where some of the home builder uh, legislation is in process. Uh, tomorrow's going to be a pretty big day for us. We have, I think, number three on the House calendar will be a bill by Joe Lovern, which is our uh, storm shelter assistance bill uh, that would allow uh, a taxpayer to claim a tax credit uh, against his income for installing a shelter in his own home, as well as gifting a shelter to somebody in need. Uh, we expect that to be number three. Uh, the Senate version of that, sponsored by Senator Watley, uh, we're going to try to get up within the next uh, couple of weeks as well. Uh, also in the House is going to be our Enhanced Penalties Bill. I think that's about number nine on the calendar. Uh, the Enhanced Penalties Bill really tries to focus in on these out-of-state professional storm chasers that come into the state after an emergency, whether it's a hurricane or tornado or whatever, uh, and take advantage of folks. This goes after those folks are being unlicensed or committing fraud. We think it's going to be a bill that will go a long way towards cleaning up a problem that has existed for many years, and we look forward uh, to having that on the floor tomorrow. That bill is sponsored by uh, Representative Matt Simpson out of Mobile. Uh, the counterpart to that bill, sponsored by Senator Randy Price, uh, we are expecting or at least hopeful that it'll be up in the Senate tomorrow as well. So we have three bills uh, potentially on the floor tomorrow in both House and Senate, so we're excited about that and, and look forward to a good day. Uh, tomorrow's also a big day when it comes to elections. Uh, we've talked to the members several times about candidates that both ABPAC and BuildPAC support. Uh, so we've done our part supporting the candidates in those ways. We now need you to get out and get the vote uh, out for these folks. Uh, we'd encourage you to vote for them. Take time to learn who the candidate is. Uh, we know tomorrow's going to be kind of an ugly day weather-wise, uh, but it's important that we get out and you exercise your right to vote, uh, no matter who it is that you vote for, uh, and we'll uh, look forward to that. Uh, we'll follow back up with you in a few days once uh, we get through this, this week and kind of give you an idea of where we are with our legislation. Until then, uh, we'll see you soon. Thank you.